So funny story guys, I actually did record this video previously but unfortunately I did not turn on my microphone because I'm using different software to do this recording over here. So I apologize for that but this recap video was supposed to be done super quick so let's try doing it super quick in about two minutes. Let's go! Hi everybody, this is CVGS, I'm the Captain here and on this recap for the Vanguard livestream for 29 June 2021, we'll be looking at the reviews and sharing our collective thoughts on them. Before we start, we want to clear up something from last week and it involves the ruling of Seeker Thing Saver Dragon with the interaction between the old version and the new one. We sent an email to the official Bushiroad support and we got a reply from them and they said, yes, you're able to do so. Through the original's ability, you'll be able to search for the new Seeker Thing Saver Dragon and perform Legion with a Blaster Blade Seeker, even though it does not have the Legion keyword. If the new Seeker Thing Saver Dragon has become a heart, the unit will no longer be in Legion state and the Blaster Blade Seeker Legion mate will be placed into the soul as part of the rule resolution. This is completely different from what we had said last week that you're not able to because of certain factors and we apologize for the misinformation. Going forward, we will make sure that this new information will be spread across all of our socials. On to the recap news, we're on the collab news week here with Overdress with Monster Strike coming out on July 23rd. And when they want our attention, they know how to get it. Because 66% of you guys voted on our community tab saying, Oh my god, those over triggers are going to be hilariously fun. Monster Strike, like with Token Rambu, needed something to catch people's attention. And so far with what we've seen, they have. For those that need a refresher, the gimmick that Monster Strike has is their Gacha Ridora set order that allows them to add cards from the top of their deck to a monster box where they can switch out cards in their hands with cards in the monster box that has the same grade. Random boost. Go! Monster Strike will get their own rare perfect guard like those in the 5 main nations. Angel of Love Mana, when placed on the Guardian Circle, choose one of your units and it cannot be hit until the end of the battle. If you have two or more cards in hand, discard a card from your hand. Defender of the Grand Paradise Gabrielle was also revealed. When placed on the Vanguard or Regard Circle, look at the top card of your deck and put it to the top of your deck or into your soul. And when this unit attacks on the Regard Circle, if your Persona wrote this turn, you may have this unit get plus 5000 power. If you do, at the end of the battle, put this unit into the soul. This does hint that Monster Strike might be playing with skills that empties out their field, which is where the Gacha Ridora comes into play. Monster Strike is getting two different over triggers that have different effects and they get funnier as we go along. To recap what the over trigger is, it's a special type of trigger that when trigger check, you remove it from play, draw a card, choose one of your units and you get plus 100 million power. If revealed as a drive check, you can activate the following effect after. Ring of Light Lucifer's additional effect is to perform one of the following effects. All of your Rhaegars get plus 10,000 power until the end of the turn, or choose one card in your damage zone and heal it. This is pretty nice. The choice of either effect makes this over trigger versatile to use, and wherever you trigger it, whether it be early or late, you have something to be able to use. If you do trigger it early, you can actually take advantage of an early heal to make the mid to late game more comfortable for you. But now we scale from nice to hilarious with Night King of the Immortal Roundtable, Alfred, I mean Arthur. Its additional effect is to perform one of the following effects, retire all of your opponents <laughs> Retire. Its additional effect is to perform one of the following effects. Retire all of your opponent's rear guards or choose one of your units and it gets plus one critical until the end of the turn. I still can't help but laugh at seeing one of those choices is retire all of your opponent's rear guards. It's such a powerful ability that really elevates interest in the Monster Strike decks. And between the two over triggers, you do really need to weigh the ups and downs of both and decide which works best for you. But at the same time also, you have something fun, really really fun in the Monster Strike decks if you do choose to invest into them. Insert Kablooey joke? Ain't nobody got time for that! So what do you guys think? Them over triggers making you warm around the collar about Monster Strike? Leave your comments below. And if you want to be part of a live conversation with us on Overdress and Vanguard, we're on Twitch for our Tuesdays live streams and Wednesdays for our discussion streams here on YouTube. So be sure to follow us on Twitch for our gaming live streams, slam that like and subscribe button and ring the ding the bell so you get notified of all of our videos when they release, be it for Vanguard or Battle Spirits. Be sure to follow us on all of our socials, we're on Facebook, Twitter and Instagram, we also have a Discord as well where you can find myself, Dempster and Leon on most nights. If you like what we do here and want to support us directly, you can join our membership where you can be like Wenhao Law, Daddy Agrieto, Samuel McKay, CoolKid9514, and Rin and have access to our meme emotes and badges during our premieres and live streams. So with that said, thank you guys again for watching and we'll see you in the next video. Bye bye!